Rant number one. Redstone and sticks. There's two materials in Minecraft that don't make any sense. I mean, soul sand doesn't make sense, but that's not it. These materials do things. And they don't do what they look like they do. They actually do what you think the other one does. Confused, it's redstone and sticks. Everyone always acts like redstone is magic. It's not. Sticks are magic. Sticks are magic, and I'm going to prove it. First, redstone. You get a big pile of redstone dust, and you lay out a trail. Okay, that's fine. Well, what's it do? It's a wire. It conducts energy. Okay. So, how do you power it? With a redstone torch or a lever. Okay... How's the torch work? You take redstone, and you put it on the end of a stick. And that is where Notch lost us all. We've established that redstone doesn't create energy, it just conducts or converts it. When you step on redstone ore, it turns physical energy into light. Okay, so putting energy into redstone conducts, so why not connect redstone to redstone ore and step on it? It doesn't work. Redstone simply isn't a power source. The sticks are the power source. How are sticks a power source, you may ask? Well, you make a lever out of a stick and cobblestone, which cobblestone is useless. You throw it away. You make four permanent torches out of a stick and coal. You need sticks to make tools, otherwise you're barehanded. Now, coal isn't infinite energy. It's not even infinite light. You put it into a furnace and it produces light and cooks things, but only for a little while. And aren't torches brighter than a furnace? And what happened to the candle that burns twice as bright and half as long? I'll tell you what happened. The sticks magically made the coal burn forever. You see, redstone torches are actually the anti-lever. When you place a lever, it's unpowered, and you have to add energy to it to turn it on by punching it. Redstone torches are the exact opposite. You place it, and it's powered. You have to add energy to turn it off. There's so much power overflowing out of these sticks that you have to power them to contain it. Think about it. Really. Really think about it. Everything that does anything for any significant amount of time requires a stick. Buttons and pressure plates can't continue to be a power source alone. They need something else. They are a piezo transducer. They receive a physical shock and produce energy. Levers and redstone torches, and regular torches, don't need that. They're just sort of on, like magic, because they are. Now, how do you make redstone torches again? Just clump redstone dust on the end of a stick. So you just clump it on the ground and you get wire. That doesn't make energy, it conducts it. So if you clump it on a stick, it doesn't make energy, it conducts it. Where does the energy come from? The stick! Because so, what else is there? Sticks. Redstones conduct the power contained in sticks. They free the magical stick power! You can't make a sword with just metal. All you can make out of metal is pants. You can't make a pick out of metal. All you can make with metal is blocks. Nothing that interacts with the world for a significant amount of time can be made without sticks. Wood magically transmutes metal into tools or weapons. You can't make rails without the wood to fuse it together, can you? If you make a rail out of only sticks, what do you get? A ladder. Ladders are fireproof. Ladders magically repel water. Ladders magically repel lava. This is because sticks are magic. Ladders are sticks to the seventh power. Ladders are magic to the seventh power. Signposts are the same way. A stick with six planks. 
six planks is 12 sticks. So a signpost is 13 sticks. Ladders are 7 sticks. 7 and 13 are powerful magical numbers. Sticks are magical. All hail sticks.